Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be doing, and not that I am recreating, but I'm very inspired by James Charles' new video of Full Face using liquid lipsticks. I was actually planning to do this video myself first, but then I was like, I don't know, maybe that's already too old and no one's gonna wanna watch that, but like, James Charles did it, so I'm like, you know what? I'm just gonna be inspired by his video, and today I'm just gonna do it. It was a little difficult to find the shades for like my face. I don't even have like a white liquid lipstick to kind of like fix everything. I don't know. Point is, it's going to be hard. But yeah. So if you guys want to keep on watching, just go ahead and keep on watching and watch me struggle. <laughs> Okay, so I'm gonna go in and prime my face with the new Wet n Wild Rose Primer Serum. This is really, really good, and I really do like that because I feel like it does keep my face very moisturized. So we're just gonna go ahead and add these. Okay, so for my foundation, I'm gonna go in with the NYX Lingerie. This is in the shade Satin Ribbon. I this is the closest thing I can get to my skin tone, and let me tell you, it's maybe not matches. But, I mean, it's too pinkish. I don't know. But I'm just going to go ahead and use this liquid lipstick. And I'm just going to blend everything. Uh, see how pink that is? And it does not look pink in the bottle. I'm just going to start blending that out before it dries. Let's see, maybe I'll blend into my skin. Okay, I'll look a little pink. I'm just going to add a little bit more. This is ridiculous because... I seriously can't find like a liquid lipstick obviously that it is my skin type and my skin tone there are very there are there's a lot of pink ones and I didn't have like yellow liquid lipsticks to mix it so I feel like this is gonna be a problem but I mean I'm looking pink okay so I'm looking really really pink it's not good but I'm going to be going in with the NYX Soft Matte Liquid Cream thing going on here. And I'm going to be using a concealer because it's kind of like the lightest one I have. So, let's see. And I'm not going to set my face because first of all, most of these are mattes. And they're very, very drying. Oh my god, I feel like it's not making a difference. My god, I have instant regrets right now. I feel like I'm looking so freaking pink it is so bad okay i'm just gonna oh but look at that coverage <laughs> i look oh no okay so for my contour i am going to be using melt cosmetics this was in the shade dream boy and it's like a brown so i'm just gonna be using this as my contour and i'm hoping this saves it might have been too high there, but let's see. Let's just contour this nose. Don't regret this whole video, but I'm gonna post it because like I may wanted to do this video and maybe it turns out good. Who knows? Who knows? Let's just hide all the imperfections that I've done. Let's let's just blend that out. <sighs> okay, wait, I could save this. I could save this guys. This is like, might be like the worst ever full face liquid lipsticks because, oh my god. Okay, so now for my eyebrows, I'm gonna go in with a Lime Crime, the shade Desire. And this is a liquid lipstick, of course. And it's like an orange one. And since I wasn't trying to do my eyebrows like black, and I don't have like a dark brown liquid lipstick, I'm just gonna go in with this Lime Crime one. I feel like this is the closest ones to my um hair color so i'm just gonna do my eyebrows orange i am telling you guys you guys have no idea how bad my face look i think it's setting in and you can see how bad it is it is so bad but just want to show you guys that i am not a sore loser and i'm going to do this and finish it because i've been wanting to post a video um, and I haven't. So this is what I'm going to be doing, you know, even though it's not bueno. Okay, so for my eyes, I'm going to be using the Lime Crime. This is a shade Power. These are the Lime Crime Velveteens. 
and I'm just gonna place this. This is like an orangey, like copper color, and I feel like it's just gonna go good with my hair and my brows already. So I'm just gonna use this, and I'm just gonna place this on the lid and blend it all out because I feel like this is a nice color for the eyes. It doesn't look that bad, trust me, it doesn't it could look worse. Okay, and with the same color, I'm gonna get that same flat brush that I had and I'm gonna be putting it on the bottom so we can connect all of these eye together because I look so fucking ridiculous, it's insane. What did I do? It's like I have like instant regret so much right now. Like I could have done like something something really simple, but now I had to do something crazy. Oh my god. Let me just blend that out now on the bottom. So now I'm just gonna go ahead and grab the NYX liquid suede metallic one. And this is in the shade Exposed. And I'm gonna be adding this on my inner corner. Just so we can add a little bit of glow because Best believe that my face needs it. And I'm just going to add some highlight with the same thing. And I'm going to add it in all the areas that I usually highlight. Let's just add some highlight here. And here. Oh uh, my god. What are you doing? We're just going to pat that. Okay, see when you pat it, it's not that weird. We want to deepen the some of the edges off to kind of make it very smoky. So I'm grabbing the shade... And NYX Liquid Suede, and this is in the shade Club Hopper, and it's like a brownie color. So I'm just gonna use this, and I'm gonna go in and blend some of like the corners out with this. And I'm hoping that helps because I best believe I need that right now. I don't know if it's oh, I think it's kind of helping. So I'm just gonna continue doing this, doing this on the other eye. I could have done something really simple, but no, I'm telling you guys, I had to do something crazy. And I'm just gonna go and add that deep color also in the inner corner, like I always like to do it so I can define like my eye. Oh my god, I should have not done that. Okay, I'll fix this. I can fix this. I'm just gonna keep adding it to this corner, but I'm gonna tap it to make it deeper. And then just blend like the edge out. Well, I am an artist and I'm going to save this. So I'm going to do it on the other eye. And I'm just going to add a little bit more black. I'm going to go in with some black. going to go in with some black. Watch me fix this. I'm going to grab some of the Everlasting Nuka Lipstick from Kat Von D and Witches. And I'm just going to add it right in the middle here to kind of deepen it. And then I'm going to be also doing it right here on the edge to deepen this edge as well, the corner, because I feel like I need that to kind of make it more edgy instead of... How did I get to this point? Oh my god. What have I done? I'm going to blend that out before it dries. Look what I have. Look at my hand. I have this theory where you can actually fix a look. I tend to go with more crazy looks. I don't really do like the natural glam looks. If you see like my page sometimes is not really like glam. So if you're coming from my Instagram, you know I kind of do these looks and I don't go simple. So, um, so far, this is how the look. I'm going to put some lashes on and I'll be right back. Okay, so I feel like I do need a little bit more highlight. So I'm just going to go ahead and use this Lime Crime Dim Diamond Crushers. I think these are liquid lipsticks. I don't know, but I'm going to use it as a highlighter. And I'm just going to dot it in this area where I feel like I need... Ooh, that was way too much. Oh, uh, oh my god. That's like rave status. Let me just add some here my news. Wondering which lashes I'm using. I am using La Miss Fury Lash... No, Miss Fury Lashes. From, wow. Oh, I am blinded. What? <laughs> I am... I'm being too much today. I'm having too much syndrome right now. I'm just gonna add it here. And then just tap it 
all over. Oh my god. So, hmm. Oh god, what did I do? So for my liquid lipstick, I am still distracted by the highlight. For my liquid lipstick, I am going to be using Dream Boy from Mel Cosmetics. I'm just going to place it just because it's like a nude brown. And I feel like I'm just doing too much already. Um, okay, so this is the final look. I honestly, I was not expecting this. The highlight doesn't look bad from the side. But it looks bad if you look forward because I might have gone too crazy with it. It's like a pinkish. I know you can see that. But anyways. Um, so yeah, this is a look. First of all, as you can tell, I was having a hard time. And the I do not match. Because seriously, like to find a color that is my skin tone it is ridiculous. You can see how pink it looks. And it looks crazy. I feel like the eyes don't look that bad. I was able to fix it and make it look really cool. Um, but yeah. So this is the final look. I hope you guys like it. And if you guys don't, just go ahead and give it a thumbs up for trying. Because, you know, a girl tried and yeah. Hmm. If you um, haven't subscribed to my channel, go ahead and please subscribe. You can subscribe down below and hit that bell notification to know when I'm going to post another video. And if you're not following me on Instagram and Twitter, you can go ahead and follow me on Twitter and Instagram. I'm going to leave the little handles right here. And I also leave the description down below. And yeah. So, look how bad that looks. I look horrible right now. Oh my, what did I do? Why didn't I do a simple look? Why? I had to do something weird. Mm. Alright guys, see you guys next time.